Okay, we've arrived at Lyria. And what we need to do now is obviously we can't fly 368 kilometers. Well, we could, we could just travel slowly 368 kilometers. I'm going to do security depot uh, Lyria 1. It's usually a good one. It's 473 kilometers away. What we need to do is just make sure that we drop off, drop out. So probably about halfway. Three, two, now. So we'll see where that puts us. Hundred and eighty four. I think we could have done better than that, but we're just going to blast along to one hundred and eighty four. Yeah, again, my stickers. My automatics have stopped working again. This happens quite a lot. Um, the little cursor thing, the uh, autopilot, just not working. Let's go. Get me there as fast as you can. I'll see where we get there. We're in that really annoying uh, bit where we are going too fast and then we can't slow ourselves down and then we fly all over the shop. So we just have to be careful here because we've not got automatic control again which is really really annoying. We're only 12 miles away so it's not going to take us long to get there. Three thousand feet left to go, and we can see the flashing beacon. That is good. Question is, is anybody here? Is anybody lurking to cause us problem and give us grief? Going to be a tricky landing. Landing gear down. do our best. So we are approaching the orphanage where we had a lot of grief yesterday, or was it the day before? And we are going to land. We are not going to collide, don't worry. And we're down. And just up. And we are down and we are exiting, but we are not lined up in a particularly great way for our parcels, I have to say. Could have done better than this. But let's get the first one delivered. Create a glass ring, weevil eggs. Where are you? Open the door and out we get. I think we could have located ourselves over here in a bit of a better spot where we can just run straight in. So I might just move the ship in a minute. But let's see. Let's go in. So this is the first time we've been here to the orphanage. We've finally uh, managed to get ourselves here without dying. So basically when you come in the orphanage, this is what it looks like. And you'll see that there's a load of shelves. And you find your delivery drop-off and you just place your box on the shelf. Very straightforward. And they're worth a good amount of money. What can we buy here? I know that you can buy stuff which is a bit, a bit dodgy here. Ultratoxin. That's uh, a lot of money. An eat um. That's another lot of money, but they haven't got very much of that. Can only get 10. And slam. Slam is even more expensive. We can get 32 slam. And we do have the money to do that, obviously. 
Hmm. Interesting stuff. I'm stuck. Not moving. Why am I not moving? Uh, also, it's always worth a look when you're here what jobs there are. Because there might be something going to where you're going to. So we want to find the next thing we want to do is found our orphanage. We want to track that. Then we're going to yellow, yellow, two to yellow. Let's have a look if there is package waiting at the orphanage. Accept that. Any more at the orphanage? No, that's a different one. So there should be one to collect then. There's our collection. Let's find my collection. Is it the same box that we've just... No, we didn't bring that. So we've dropped one off, we've picked one up. We go to the door. Let go out. Go back to the ship. I'm going to move the ship over here, I think. It's a long way to keep running back over here. Although I think we've only got one more to take in, so probably not. Maybe not worth it. I don't think I can get it in here anyway. There's no way. No way. There's no way I'm going to be able to get that in there. So let's do this. Let's go back over here. We're going to have to leave our parcel unattended for a second. I know, I know anybody who's delivered parcels will think that's not very good, you're leaving your parcel unattended, but we can't do anything about it because we're going to have to move the ship. So let's go and move the ship. This is not the kind of place where you want to be. Since we have to move the ship. I mean, now we're going to move the ship at the orphanage, and they're really not the kind of places where you want to be moving the ship. But I think we have to. Okay. So, shift moving. Engines on. Up we go. Why are we not? What's happening here? We're going round and round instead of where we're supposed to be. I think we're in the wrong view. That's the problem. So, let's just move ourselves where we want to move to and hopefully then we can just get ourselves down again oh, that's not going to work either I don't think let's try that engine off Let's try that and see how we can do with that. How did we do? Still got this flipping diamond here, even though we've sold it. Do they not want it or something? Can we get... No, there's no way we're going to get in there. That's worse. I don't understand this. I've picked up and dropped off here before and I've never had this problem. What is going on? I'm now wondering if this is what happened to my man the other day when he couldn't get... This is a definite reason to stop using the freelancer. Oh, now we're getting in bed. Ah, oh, you know, some days there is just... you yeah, just the, the, the... Some days... It starts to it's ultra frustrating and this is one of those days. I don't really understand... Exit bed. I have to be very careful not to press log out, or otherwise I will just literally log out and that be that. So, uh, yeah, now we have to have a little think. Now we have to get out. Man, this is annoying. All I wanted to do was move the ship again. But this happens a lot, unfortunately, with the freelancer, and it's one of the reasons, again, that I don't like freelancer. Ah, annoying ship. Right. So. Engines are on. We are up. Take it off. And then we're going to go outside and have a look. What can we do? Do we think we can move that way? This is definitely what that guy was doing the other day. 
I definitely think he was moving around like this to try and, try and get his door near the... I've moved around too much now. Right, let's go with that. Not ideal, but let's try it. Moving around with my door open, not what I want to be doing. But I've just about had enough of this malarkey. Can I now get back into the ship? Hopefully I can. Okay, we're in. Finally, please. No, 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 that's not... No! Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, which one's going here? That is the question. Tracking the order, which is for the orphanage. No, pick up from the orphanage. Orphanage, trap that one. Let's get that one delivered and then we can get out of here. It's none of them. It's this one. That one. Finally. Drop me box now, haven't I? Okay, we're nearly there. Finally, a final delivery drop off. Not final one, I mean final one for the orphanage, so we're off. We yeah, have done at the orphanage. Where are we going to next? I'll have to have a look. Yella, I think. Old Yella. Yella. Yella it is. Our business is done at the orphanage. When we're getting back in the ship, we should have received money. And we have three boxes still to deliver. So let's get our box tracked. Accept your jobs. We're going to yellow. Which one's going to have stash house, stash house, stash house? They're all for stash house, so we'll track that. Hopefully, they'll all be for the same stash house. Let's go. We should hopefully be able to travel immediately straight to that destination. It's going to tell us it's obstructed. Come on. Give us the delivery drop off. Why are you not giving it to us? No. So I'm going to have to go in to here. 387, getting closer to that 400,000. <sighs> Our corp. No, that's where we are. We're going to Crusader. Set route. Let's go. We're off to Crusader. I shall see you when I get there. So we are nearly back at Yella. We are just quantuming over to Yellow, then we'll try and do the stash house. Then I think we will end our day at Grim Hex because uh, we need to put down a spawn point. Otherwise, next time we'll be back at that flipping rest stop space station uh, that is um, 
Everest Sky Harbour and I'm st- sick of spending so much time at Everest Sky Harbour. So now we need to get ourselves to that delivery drop off. So that's, how far is that? Uh, 262. Now we need something a bit further away than that maybe. What else have we got? That's uh, 800 and something. Let's go with this one and we'll see if we can get Reasonably near. Ah, uh, we're, we're going the wrong way there, we're going the wrong way. That's no good, we'll have to look for something else. Engine's back on. Let's try again. So it's 400 kilometres over there. What else is there that we can travel to? 196, that's no good. Let's try this one. Maybe this one will get us a little bit nearer. So again, it's just a matter of flying and then when we get to like 350, engines off. And then we'll see, we'll see where we are when, when it all stops moving. 200. Well, it's not a lot I can do now. I think I'm just going to have to keep flying, flying forward. So we are almost at our location for our next drop off, which is a stash house in yellow. Stash house on yellow. It's just down there. Let's get our speed down a bit. Landing gear down. Uh, yeah, so I don't remember if I've been to this one before. I think I might have because it's the one in the little um, thingy. But we've got the same problem here. We haven't got the automatic, so we're going to drift about all over the shop. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anybody here, so that's good. I'm hoping that all three parcels have to go to the stash house here, but it's quite possible that they won't. It's quite possible that only one of them will, and then the rest will go to another stash house. Uh, so we'll just have to see. But as I say, hopefully they will all go to the same one. And we're just going to try and put ourselves down right by the door. Because I always find that easier to deal with. Right, but we don't necessarily want to be... Oh, no, we're perfect. Oh, beauty. Absolutely fantastic. Let's go. Let's go get our box and get it delivered. And hopefully, with a bit of luck, there is... All three of them are going to the same spot. No, not you. Place. Yes, you. And the door. Stash house. And what do we need? Close the door. Let's go. Stash house. Where they stash things. There we go. This is the stash house, very similar to the orphanage. Uh, it's not letting me drop, drop off. Why is that? Oh, because I've dropped the flipping box of computers again. Every time. It's 
So we're nearly at the end, we've nearly delivered our box of computers. Hopefully now we'll go out and check. Is there a Covalex? No, there isn't a Covalex here. What can we buy? I think it's probably the same stuff, yeah. I don't know where I can sell that, so I'm not going to uh, buy any right at this moment. Let's see if I can deliver another parcel, or whether I'm going to have to go somewhere else to do that. Have a look. Accepted. We've got two left. Yeah, it's the same stash house. So with a bit of luck, all of these parcels will be able to be delivered here. And there's nobody else here. This was quite a good delivery run, really. So I'm quite pleased with my progress today. Um, this is quite a good delivery run starting at Everest Sky Harbour um, and then uh, going to Orange, then to the orphanage and now to the stash house on Yella. This means that I'll be right back at the um, Grim Hex and I could start again tomorrow with Grim Hex if I wanted to, going all the way back to Orange and then working back to the, uh, to the orphanage and Samson and Sons. Nice little earning round robin, really. So if you need to earn lots of money quickly in uh, contracts available, come and see me. It's available again. I want to go and do that contract, but I don't really want to do it now because uh, it's quite late. Uh, I've been playing for quite a while. Uh, and we've nearly completed this package run, which we've tried to complete a package run for quite a few videos now. We've finally done one. And this one... Where's the delivery? I oh know, don't tell me this one's not for here. No, I need to track it, that's the problem. Four metres. There we go, the final delivery. Delivery complete, delivered to a stash house on Yella. We have done it, we have completed package run, we've picked up, we've dropped off, we've come from Everest Sky Harbour to the orphanage and finally to a stash house on Yella, we've earned at least 40,000 40, today, let's have a look, let's just shut our door, let's have a look what we've got, so we're on 410,000, so I think that's the first time that we've gone over 410,000, I think we've probably earned at least 40,000 uh, on that run today. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to Grim Hex and log out there because if I do that, then uh, actually, uh, as an experiment, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and log out in one of these beds. And I'm going to see what happens and I'll see where I end up um, when I next play. So thank you very much, uh, you've been great and I'll see you next time please if you haven't done already like this video and hit the subscribe button. This is T-Shot Cowboy out.